So we are all fully aware that the next update for Horizon 5 is going to have some kind of Chinese theme to it. It is Lunar New Year after all, which is the Chinese New Year, though a little bit different from us normal folk. You may have seen we have already discussed the leak that happened last week, which actually showed us two of the upcoming cars that are going to be within this update. Well, we now have even more cars confirmed for the Series 30 update, thanks to the live stream thumbnail. We'll touch on that today and nail down our educated predictions for the Series 30 update. So it's been announced that we are getting the Forza Monthly, which will tell us everything about this update this Friday, the January the 26th. Now, thanks to that live stream, we have the thumbnail from the live stream that was also posted over on Twitter and within that we can see what looks to be two new cars that are not in the game we can guess straight away that these cars will be within the series 30 along with the other two cars that were already leaked now these two cars in question let's narrow down what they are now at first glance it might look like two different cars however after looking into them looking at the exact models it appears that this is actually the same car pictured twice I don't really know why they've done that, it's a little bit strange. We're definitely getting more than just this car and the other two in this update. I'm pretty damn sure at least, so so maybe that means something. But the car in question is in fact the Link & Co 05. Now I'm not entirely clued up on these particular cars, I have done a bit of research and I'm going to tell you about them now. Link & Co is a Chinese Swedish automotive brand co-owned by Geely Automotive Holdings and Volvo. We have another Link & Co car already in the game, I believe last year it came. It is the 05 Plus that is coming to the game in this next update judging by what we can see in the Forza Monthly thumbnail. We can see that this image right here shows the rear of the car and it matches up perfectly with what's in the thumbnail and this image right here shows the front of the car. Yes it's green and it's actually black in the Forza Monthly thumbnail but it does appear to be the same car. Now I've seen a few people say oh is it the Lincoln Co 02 hatchback which is this car here. It doesn't appear to be. If you look closely enough at the front of the car there are some very small differences and the rear of the car is also different as well. The Lincoln Co 03, this one here is the car that is currently in Horizon 5 and appears we're getting the 05 as well. Now the question is, as you may remember the leaks if you didn't see them in my last video, these images here were leaked and we can see two cars in here. This is some kind of Chinese promotional advert slash banner that was leaked and it has the MG Cyberster and the MG MG7 with two dates on them. Now we can narrow down as we said that the MG is coming on the third week and the Cyberster is coming on day one which means that the Cyberster is probably probably one of the car pack cars is the Lincoln Co going to be a car pack car or is it going to be in the festival playlist we can't narrow that down just yet if you're wondering where the evidence of the car pack comes from it's from this leaked image here and at the bottom it says a prize is the Chinese car package DLC so it's not confirmed that we're getting a car pack but it's pretty damn likely. If we do get a car pack, I will be giving away codes as usual, so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss when you can enter to win those codes. I want you guys to get your predictions in, take in all the information I give you today and put in some guesses as to what cars you think are coming in the next update. If any of you actually get it pretty accurate and guess a few cars, I'll make sure to give you one of the car pack codes if there are any. So we know we're getting the two MGs, we know we're getting the Lincoln Co of some sorts, but what else could we be getting? Now because the MGs and this are both Chinese manufacturers, Chinese cars, it is pretty safe to say that the likelihood of the other cars in this update also being Chinese are very likely. First we only have the MGs to look at but now we've got this as well and it's in the Forza Monthly poster, they're definitely putting an emphasis on Chinese so that's fine with me. I've already seen a bit of a, an iffy reception of people that don't really want cars like this that's fair enough everybody has their own preference. We have to remember though Lunar New Year is related to a Chinese event, Chinese celebrations. We can expect Chinese cars in this update, it just makes sense. So can we narrow down what other cars might be in this update based on the information we'll have? Well, kind of. If we go to the leaked car list, these are cars that have been found in the files that are not in the game yet, there are not really any Chinese cars on there at all apart from the Lincoln Co 03 TCR. Now the 03 is already in Horizon 5 but the TCR which is the touring car kind of version is not. Perhaps this is the update this makes an appearance to the game. It's possible it is on this list as one of the leaks. 
Um, again, we've got to take all of these with a grain of salt. But other than that, I can't see any standout Chinese cars. So we can't go off elite car list for much information. What we can do is have a look at some of the top selling Chinese cars over in China. Maybe it will give us some kind of guess as to what to look for. The Wuling Hongwang, which is already in Horizon 5, is at the top of the list. And then there's surprisingly quite a few Volkswagens. The La Vita, the Sagittar, the Bora, the Jetta and the Santana. Again, a few more Volkswagens. So not every car that we receive in this update will be a Wuling Hongwang car. It might just be a Volkswagen or a Chevrolet or a Kia, something that's got Chinese sort of relevance, but not necessarily a Chinese brand. The Polestar logo was found in the files a few months ago. So obviously we've got to take that into consideration that that could very well be coming. We have proven by now that cars that have had things spotted in the files about them do have a little bit more of an increased likelihood of making it to the game and as we mentioned in the previous video just general popular Chinese cars if they're gonna come in any update it is probably this one and if you are a player that is missing some of the older Chinese cars Chinese cars that have been added to the game that are exclusive that you haven't managed to obtain such as the Neo EP9 this is an update where we could very likely see these appear back in the festival playlist as rewards so if you're missing any of these cars now is your chance to get them supposedly that's definitely a possibility if you remember in the last video we showed that the chevrolet chevy the mexico version was kind of being shown on the Forza horizon 5 spanish twitter account we did take that into, cons into consideration about maybe they were hinting that this is coming it doesn't really fit the genre of this update at all it still is very strange that they were hinting about this but what's very interesting is actually clicking on the chevrolet chevy now on the forums it did have two votes it now has 1510 votes and is actually sixth on the entire list of top voted cars so this tweet has obviously had a great effect in getting it up there however based on what we've seen so far whereas this update does seem to be focusing on the chinese cars i don't think the chevrolet chevy or the Vauxhall corsa we're being hinted at for this update i might be completely wrong though let's please not give this update much hate i'm sure there's lots of people lots of chinese players that are happy to see an update that's got a bit of relevance to them as tesco meal deal says over on twitter it's a lunar new year it's a chinese holiday you can't be mad at them adding chinese cars we'll find out on friday and you can be sure that i'll be one of the first people to pop out a video explaining everything about the update in detail now speaking of updates I don't really want to show you this, but I'm going to because it's Forza related. Forza have announced a Forza newsletter, which you can sign up for and you can get all the Forza news um, and latest information on both Forza games direct to your inbox. If you go to Forza.net slash newsletter, sign in, pop in your details and you will be on the list and receive regular emails. Now, go and do it if you want. I'd ask you not to and instead watch my videos to learn about updates but you're well within your right to join up with this newsletter if you really want to. Only a couple of days away till Series 30 guys, hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you all later.